I'm Marmot. I'm one of the field instructors at Walden West Outdoor School, and I'm here for the Meet the Staff interview, so you can get to know me a little bit better. Well, this is Willow. She's a Border Collie mix that was rescued from the shelter. She's only 11 months old, but she's really smart. She already knows how to walk off the leash. We trained her to do this by playing a game where me and my wife sit apart and call her name. And when she comes, she gets a treat. And now when we're at the beach, she stays right with us. We can even call her away from other dogs and birds. We've only had her for about a month and she's already a really good dog. Right now, surfing is definitely my main sport. I live in Santa Cruz and surf almost daily. Growing up skating, I've always been drawn to it. When I was 25, I spent six months in Hawaii learning to surf and I was hooked. Ever since, it's been a huge part of my life. Now I have a deep love and respect for the ocean. Another sport that I love but don't get to do very often is snowboarding. Every spring, my wife and I go to Colorado to see my wife's side of the family, and if we're lucky, get to ride powder for about a week. In college, I used to get season passes, but these days, one week is all we get. Well, before I worked for Walden West, I worked for a mountaineering climbing company for three years. And I would go into the backcountry for two to three weeks at a time and climb mountains. Even in my off time, I would go climbing with friends. And so when I came to Walden West, I wanted a name that reflected my mountain personality. And marmots are one of two animals that can live above tree line in the alpine zone. And that's why I chose marmot. I play the djembe, which is a West African drum. And I learned by taking West African drumming lessons. I even played for some West African dance classes. Taking classes is really fun because you get to meet and play with other people. However, just recently, with the shelter in place, I've been watching how-to videos, so if you don't have any classes near you, this could be an option if you're interested. Well, one of my hobbies is gardening. I like to grow my own food because it reduces my impact and saves money. If you're interested in gardening too, check out my how-to videos on YouTube. Well, traveling is definitely a huge passion of mine, and I prioritize it. A goal of mine has been to travel outside the country every other year. Places that I've traveled to include Mexico and all through Central America, all through Southeast Asia, and Sri Lanka, and most recently, New Zealand. We usually focus our trips on seeing nature through activities like surfing and diving and hiking. We also usually travel on a budget by camping or staying in hostels and taking public transportation. And we love traveling this way because we get to meet lots of local people with different perspectives. Another thing I love about traveling is seeing how people live in less developed countries. It always reminds me that you don't need a lot of stuff to be happy. Well, first you need to grow your hair really long. And then stop brushing it. They will form naturally, but you do have to wash it. In fact, washing it dries out your hair and speeds up the process. You also have to separate it out into the size dreads that you want. Otherwise, you'll end up with one giant dread, and that would be uncomfortable. Well, that's about it. I hope you got to know me a little bit better, and I look forward to learning about you when you come up to camp. <laughs>